Coach, how about three and two and four and one, especially when the motion's out late to cone or to cut side? Yeah. We get empty and we, we get empty and we like to say, well, you won. No, I'm kidding. We don't do that. That's a joke. So if we're going to stay in the call and we're not going to try to double or triple call it, we're going to stay in the call. We cut the front up. So that's the first thing to handle the quarterback, right? If you haven't noticed, the number one problem with this coverage is how do we handle quarterback run? So you got to find ways to handle quarterback run, obviously, when he scrambles. You're going to play close coverage. So first thing we'll do, right, is if I'm playing cut on empty, we'll just play the cut side and we'll play the sleeve side, right? Like that's easy. And we'll play cut. So that's easy, right? But if he motions out here, we will tell the will you have all of him on what we call, some people call it swoop, some people call it fast motion. So he'll take all of it. The weak side, uh, the will linebacker will take all of it. The weak side will keep his cone bracket on the number one receiver. By game plan, because our alignments are set up to where it's really easy for us to go into a cut side, right, and for him to go cut the one, we'll say, guys, we're going to play on the cone when we get that fast motion. We're going to say cut, 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 and corner, don't move. Just don't move. A lot of times we'll, we'll transition to playing a club technique outside shade. And now when they want to run like fast motion glance, fast motion slant, shit like that, he's already cut one, he's half over one. We run the mandatory outside, that's fine. Corner has leverage on the flat guy. So I'll do that when I get a lot of three by two type of fast motion. Four by ones is hard. Um, so the first thing that we'll do against quads, I gotta do one of two things and it's based upon, do I wanna keep the cone um, on the backside or not? Do I wanna keep the, the double team on the backside? The first thing to do is say no. There's no more cone, the corner's playing Meg. So he's playing inside on top. The weak side safety is now gonna play poach. So he's gonna rerun pass and on pass, he's gonna go poach the number four. So he's gonna poach number four vertical, okay? We are gonna play Steeler on one, two, three. The corner has one, strong safety's playing on two. My back is playing on three, free safety playing on three. Will linebacker will play four to first. So he knows he has all of four unless four is fast. If four is fast, we're gonna push it between the mic and the will. If four is fast, we're gonna push it between the mic and the will. Strong safety is not involved, free safety is not involved, corn is not involved. Okay, so same thing if we get a fast four coming out of the backfield, we get that, we will push it between the will and the mic. So now the mic will take it and the will now cut number three. We'll recount. However, if it's quads, right, he's starting right here. So he knows he has number four unless four is fast. Okay? So that way we try to get help on four vertical. The second way to do it is if we do not want to play Meg back here, if we want to play our cone or we want to play our cut or whatever, we'll play our Meg cone concept. We will, based on who the receivers are, we like to play matchup. Okay, but let's assume the one and the two are fine. We're going to play the corner on one, okay, the strong safety on two. Corner on one, strong safety on two. We're going to roll down, excuse me, sorry, we can't roll down. I like to do it this way. I like to do it like this. So, mic on one, corner on two. Roll down, strong safeties here, free safeties here, will backers there, based on your matchup. And the reason you say I like to put the corner on one is if I put the corner on the X, right? Most of the time they're not they're not throwing the vertical to the, the single X. So the mic will go take full uh, take the number one, and then we'll play it on those guys between the will, free safety, and strong safety. The other way you can do it is you can. Excuse me. So if I wanted to, I could say, I'm going to recount and I'm going to put my corner on their whatever receiver 
Like I'm going to put corner on four. Or I'm going to put might on four. Or I'm going to put will on four. And now we reach out from there. So he has all of four. Corner has all of one. Strong safety, free safety, linebacker. So those are some different ways that we have done it before. The easy one is to do the mat, like the poach concept on that back end. But if you can't poach it because you got to double the number one receiver, or you got to double that number one in the backside, you got to do some different variables.